Hi, this is Gabe Romero with Man Packing and Martin Fleur with Fresh Leaf Farms. We're here to give you March's field report. And like always, it's the most wonderful time of the year. It's transition. We're gearing up for it. And looking at this weather we've had in the Salinas Valley, it's been rainy, way rainy, way wet. So Martin, give us kind of an idea of what's going on up here as far as plantings. Yeah, so plantings have been, for the most part, able to get in on schedule. It's everything that happens after that that's been screwed up. So thinning, weeding, fertilizing, all of that has been delayed. We just can't get in with tractors and do any of the preventative stuff that we need to do to keep the crops growing healthy. Um, the splashing in the water is also going to cause a lot of disease pressure, anthracnose, other things, which may last for a while. Well shoot, we're hoping for a little bit of Mother Nature's luck. I mean, it's St. Patrick's Day coming up, so maybe we can get transition, but I mean, the overall outlook, it's going to be a little bit difficult, a little tricky as we move up here. How's Yuma looking? You know, Yuma's, um, I think, going to be finishing okay. We're still seeing uh, quite a bit of blister and things like romaine from the, the really cold frost that we've had down there. Uh, Timing-wise, we're hoping to delay our move back up here as much as we can to hope to get a little bit more size and weight and some of the stuff up here so we don't dig ourselves into a hole. Um, so it's it's probably gonna the timing's actually probably gonna work out okay but overall i think yields and weights up here are gonna be tough uh, until we get it into the groove up here and really see how some of this disease pressure and things are really going to hit us and how bad it's going to be certainly and obviously the temperatures have a lot to do with that next week the next 10 days looks like you know low 60s to and during the day and as, as well as nighttime temps you know low 40s yeah you know growing conditions up here has it been difficult it's been rough yeah so in, in addition to all the wet and the lack of oxygen getting down into the root zone um the cold temps have really kind of slowed things down um you know typically we're in cooler weather stuff this time of the year variety wise um but uh yeah stuff's definitely behind schedule at this point at least at least seven days at this point is what we're thinking so we've moved our move back for the facility back about a week and hoping that that's gonna line things back up uh, without too much of a gap in between. So transition back from Yuma to the Salinas Valley, obviously as an industry, we're dealing with the rainy weather and implications of that nature. Hopefully we'll have a little bit of luck with mother nature and we'll get growing temps up to a normal level, but we'll keep you posted as we move forward. And from Gabe Romero and Martin Fluel, we'll see you in the next field report.